Hi, gorgeous ghouls. How's everyone doing today? I hope you're doing fantastic and you're ready for a review of a contact lens company. Spit that out. I'm sorry. <laughs> Okay, yes, these are actual, like the special effects colored lenses, the um, fun Halloween type. That's what I chose from the site. So if you want to see what I got, stick around. Hi, ghouls. I hope everybody's doing well and you're ready to see a video from a, I guess it's a new contact lens shop that has like the normal different colors variations but also has the um special effects halloween lens the cool ones <laughs> you know what i mean you know what i'm saying so they reached out to me i don't know a month month and a half ago and i received the package yesterday the place is called miss eyes and they offered me in exchange for two pair for me to do a video, some photos, whatever, well, video, to um, showcase some of their lenses. And I did, I said, sure, why not? So I do have a coupon code for, and it's unlimited time, 10% off your order. So I will have all those details in the description. I believe the code is ghoul, like old school ghoul, but ghoul. And so let's get into this. They arrived in a mailer and this box was inside. And the reason I'm doing this at my vanity this time is because I wanna show you from the process of getting them and trying them on for the first time. And you know, the whole, the whole process. My daughter, I believe it was, asked me something about showing her how to put in contacts one time. So, you know, some people don't know. I've been wearing contacts. I wore them religiously for 20 years probably before I developed um, needing bifocals. So now I just get contacts that have no prescription in them and wear my glasses on them because I like having my statement glasses. So open the box and here we have two cases with the stuff included that you need with it for storing your lenses once they arrive little case they're so cute i love these little cases they're just super cute and it has your lens holder i love the colors they make me very happy something for i used to use these when i had rigid contacts to take my contacts out so i don't really know i've never used this other than for that and then there's, so you can handle them if you need to. Now, make sure you always wash your hands before doing them. I'm sure you all know these things. But I'm going to go ahead and open up both of these and get them ready for when I do what I'm going to do. Now, the last place that I did a video for, they had mentioned taking the contacts out of these and putting them in these in some solution for eight hours before I used them. I've never, ever, ever had to do that with any other kind before. So I'm not sure if I'm supposed to do it with these. Uh, it didn't say so. And there's nothing on here other than what's in the package, the lot number, all the deets. And here's the first pair. They are green. And I don't know. I will put the name on the screen because I'm not sure if that's it. Yeah, I don't see a name on it. Looking around here to see it. It might be on the package itself, though, when I open it up. So, like I said, I'm going to take these out, the storage containers. All right, box out of the way. So, I hope y'all can see okay. I turned down the lighting because it was very, very, there. Let's turn it up a little bit for this video so let's see what we have here this is the other color aren't they pretty oh i'm excited didn't even realize that they arrived right now and it was the perfect time for christmas and it's red and green i thought well that's kind of crazy isn't it that it just happened to work out that way let me open these up 
and we will get on with this video. I don't want y'all being here forever, but I do want to do right by the company. And as usual, this is what they arrive in. And I still don't see the names. Oh, yes, they're on the end. My bad. These are Enchanted Black. These ones. I want to try red. I've never tried red before. I used to wear the, the white out contacts or the Manson contacts with the line around them also in the past. That was my favorites. But Enchanted Black and the other pair. Let's set these over here to the side so nothing gets mixed up or confused. These are called Green Block. And they are wicked green. They're not like regular green eyes. They are specially green. So, and I really couldn't decide. There were so many choices and I was really had, I was like, which ones do I want? And I knew I wasn't, I didn't want to get the white out ones because that's what I usually go for. And I wanted to give you all something different. So, which one should we do first? Green? Let's just go green first, and then we'll bam with the red afterward. All right. Solution. I said I'm going green first, didn't I? So let's switch these around. Totally backward. All right. Now, I don't know how other people do their things. Missy's back there. Excuse her. Um how they put their contacts in. Some people, they do them this way. They put them in the side. They slide them over. I just pop it in. I've been doing it for so many years that that's all I need to do. Now, they will water. My eyes have already been watering, so yay. But my eyes will water at first because I don't wear them as often as I used to. But we are going to see here. Like I said, these have no prescription, so it will not change my vision at all. I don't have to put my glasses on, which I'm also going to do. And I don't know if it's going to, I'll try to move my head where the lighting won't affect it. But let's see. Here's my eyes. Okay, my hazel eyes. And I'm going to open up one of these if I can get it. And since these are not prescription. It doesn't matter which one goes where. Okay, I guess I don't want to open these. These are on here. Good. Wow. I've never had a problem opening them either. Mm. Not digging that. I mean, yeah, for safety's sake, that's awesome, but that was difficult to do. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and open both of them up since that was so difficult. Yeah, that one wasn't as bad. Pull them back. All right. And I'm going to reach in. And I'm going to get the contact out. All right. Here we have a contact. Now, I will show you here. There's a right and a wrong when you look at these. They should make a perfect cup without the edges pointing out. Now, I don't know how well you can see this, but the this is correct. Let me flip them the wrong way. Now you see the bowl has an edge that goes outward. Incorrect. So you want to flip them back over. And then I take this, wash them off really well with my cleaner, with the solution, contact solution. Dry my hand off here. I bought, yeah, bought a paper towel in here. Come to find it. And here's the first one. Like I said, I don't want wet on my hands though for that. I do this. And there's the first one. Now I will say that with my lights right now, my pupil is very what do you call it? Small, so it's not covering that area, and that's not making me very happy either. But look at that difference. Let me see if I can turn it down. Take up. See, I hate that those lights are like that for you guys. I'm gonna take some pictures also, and I'll try to remember to insert them in there. All right, let's do the other one. Here we go. 
Nope, if I can get it out of there. Once again, you gotta do the thing where you check and make sure. I believe that's right. See? It's correct, there's no bowl there. No outward bowl. Of course, there's a bowl there. Clean them off, do my whole dealio. I think I need to try to get some pictures in the other lighting too, so I can see. There it go. Ooh, my eyes water, but it's not water because it's it has some solution in there. Let me get it dry. Oh, they're really pretty. Like I said, I need to get these in different lighting though. There's the green. Let me see if I can bring y'all in a little bit here. Maybe I should just stand up, maybe. Let y'all see. There you go. There you go. You can see them. You also see all my light shape there. But that's the first pair. And let me see. Let me blink and see how comfortable they are. The watering, take my word for it. See, I'm losing makeup. I was already watering today. So that was not a good thing. These are my allergies from makeup. So it is in no way indicative of what the contacts would do. Blinking. Yeah, they're comfortable. These are actually very, very comfortable. Hmm. I like them. Like I said, I'm going to go in the other room and snap some photos where I'm not in this light. So I thought this was gonna work really well, but, and you can see them. There's no doubt about it that you can see them, but I wanna get it where my pupil isn't quite so small so that you can see the black of that. I will say the pupil area though is really large. So I would think smaller pupils, if you don't have really big eyes or whatever, these might not be the ones for you. And man, I've lost a lot of makeup right on that side there. Look at that. Whatever. So there's the first ones. And now let me do the thing you do and take them out. I always set mine up where my right eye is on the right side and left eye is on the left side. And the reason I say that even though they're not prescription and they both have a zero prescription in them, they're 0, 0.00, still, if you wear them, you put them in the same eye, it will shape to that eye because your eyes are different. So it's always smart to keep them in the same eyes. Also helps if you know there's a problem later down the line, then you know, well, it was this eye and it always was this one because this is where I kept that contact. And this is mainly just because I used to have prescription contacts and I need to keep them separate, but I still do. Oh, wow, they're really showing right there. Hope y'all can see them as good as I can. I think you can. So we got Christmas green. Let's go with it. Now taking them out, this is all I do. Like I said, other people lift and pull and move things to the side, but this is just how I do it. Just like that. And then you wanna kind of rinse it a little bit. I don't like putting it right in there because I've had makeup on and it's just gonna, so pop them in there. It's probably smart to clean them too. Put the stuff on, rub them rinse them, all that stuff. But right now I'm not gonna do all that because I'm gonna get on to the next pair for you. And I'm trying to do this in time so you see how quickly you can do these things. That's it. Because when you're wearing makeup, your makeup will get on the contacts. It will build up over time on the contacts, so. And I'm sure many of you have worn contacts and already know these things, but just let me preach it to you. All right, next we have Enchanted Black. I'm excited for these. I have never had a red pair of contacts. So, see how green those are? Yeah. All right, that's the green block. And now let me get this open. Enchanted Black. All right, these are hard to open again. Give me a second, guys. Like I said, I've never had any that are this difficult to open. But 
There you go. There's one. And any fluid that's in there, just you toss it. You don't reuse it. You don't do any of that stuff. Don't share your contacts with anyone. You're just asking for an eye infection. All right, here we go. All right, let's do these now. All right, and see my eyes, my hazel eyes. Let's see what we got here. Get it out of there. Clean, rinse, clean. I do this over the sink normally, so. And this is correct. It will, like, when it's correct, it's easy to. Make sure that's correct. To manipulate them, they move easier. If they're not, they're, they're harder to. Like, I can do this and they, they move. The other way, they'll kind of fight it because they're not in the right spot. And here we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> These are cool. <laughs> I said, let me get the little bit of water out. These are cool. And I will do the same thing. Go and get pictures in the other light to show where the pupil's a little bit bigger. But I really feel like these are really for people who have very large pupils to begin with. And as you can see, obviously I don't. I thought I did, but I don't. I guess, I don't know. Just do the thing we do. Uh-oh. Try again. See, and that's the thing, if you don't hold both of them open, that happens sometimes. But as I've said before, it's just how I've just been doing them for so long. Oh, something's in my eye. Makeup or something in my eye. All right. Okay, most people do this. And then they stick them in. And they'll put them aside and slide it over onto it. Okay. These are pretty. Oh, these are cool. So the one's watering still. Still has the... This one doesn't feel as comfortable, but I think it's because I already had something in my eye a while ago. And I'm very upset with how bad my eyeshadow has gotten on this side. All right, and there's these. Let me get up closer. And I will take pictures I'm going to add them up here. There's room here, so I will add a picture of how it looks with the pupil more out there. So, yeah. So yes, I do have a code, and this is Miss Eyes. And it took about a month to get them, so it's gonna take a minute. It's gonna be a hot minute. The diet. Sorry, the diameter 14.5. And I believe, I don't know, I think that has something to do with the pupil area. It says diameter, but I think that also has something to do because I've seen it before and the last company told me certain things wouldn't work or whatever. But anyway, my point being is that these are super comfortable. And the only reason this eye is watering is because, like I said, I had something in my eye. But they are very, this eye, it's like you don't have a contact in there. So yes, these are pretty amazing. I like the red. So cool. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this video. And like I said, there is a coupon code, Ghoul, for 10% off your order. And it's unlimited quantity and time, I do believe. I will put all the details in the 
description box. So yeah, head over, get some contacts, treat yourself to something special. Um, these are super comfortable. I actually think they're more comfortable than the last, the last ones I said were so comfortable. These are, wow. And I don't wear contacts that much anymore at all. I do for photos sometimes and, you know, things like that. But for me to put them in and they're like, they're not bothering me at all at all so yeah they're very comfortable if this would have been your first pair i'm sure these would be very comfortable yeah so like i said i'm going to insert some pictures i probably already have but anyway i just wanted to tell you all that first of all thank you for watching the video and you're beautiful just the way you are and don't let anyone take away your shine and i'll talk to y'all next time bye